Oh. Every time that happens, I, I hope that the, the game has frozen. Yeah, alright, that swimming section wasn't nearly as spooky as I thought it was going to be. That's one of my fears, is the, is the ocean, the open ocean, and, like, some big monster creature being in it. Like, th that's why I have a fear of whales. They're just too big, you don't need them. But that didn't really... I don't know, as someone who is afraid of the ocean, and that almost exact scenario, that was not very spooky. Look, by the lighthouse. Yes, that must be it. Fantastic. I'm shocked the Trudons just disappeared. Like, there's nothing else Wait, I don't see anyone on it. Maybe going on here. Like, they just disappeared. Maybe Billy ate them. Oh. Well, well, well. Fortune smiles upon the brave. Hey, Dad! I Dad. thought I'd worked everything out. Hadn't accounted for a little thief here. Well played, Jess. Well played. But then, I was sure I had buried my ticket off this island at the bottom of the sea. But... Lo and behold, you slippery sons of bitches survived. Wait, 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 wait. Did you, did you swim out of there? You bastard. What will your bosses think when they learn that you tried to murder us? But they won't learn. Well, I mean, we got to murder him one first, way or another, so. You're not going to tell them. I just don't know how we got to this point, Nima. You were the last one of my kind I thought I could trust. My kind? Didn't start out that way, but we what is happening? This is such a weird Sophia. character turn. But now, I don't even have like he started off as like a me. comic it's relief asshole. Now he's just a, a stupid asshole. I mean, I'm glad this is happening because again, it means we get to kill him. Most hurt. You looking for this? You know, things don't have to be this way. We'll kiss and make up and share this payout just like we planned. I know exactly how this is gonna end. I am sorry I did not see your true if self If this doesn't though, end with us fighting us him, and, and then the T-Rex comes in and eats him at the end, like, it's it's gonna be exactly- I, I can picture it, but I can't explain on, it, like, easy, we're boy. gonna be fighting, and come as I go to do the finishing the mark, blow, like the T-Rex is gonna come in and eat him, even though, you this? know, I don't know how a T-Rex can sneak up on you. They are worth more than your pathetic life! I would trade your life even for Oscars. No more talk. Shut up and fight. Yeah, I mean, come on. This is what I've been waiting for all game and I'm fucking it up. Like, bad. Man, they, they also keep reusing that, that one noise. Like, her in pain from the beginning of the game. And it doesn't fit any of the situations that they use it in. God damn, these these are quick. You need to be like really right on it with this. How do I keep missing the X button prompt? I'm missing this one. I almost want to restart this one. Ow. Come on, Jerry, get in on this. Oh no, it's just like the end of a way out. Which means I have to win this. I can't let Leo down. That was harder than a, uh, than a way out. Sound like he was falling. Oh, there we go. Is that the little thing we're fighting over? Oh, huh? What? Oh my god. That, what's that? I can have This it? is impossible. Why so generous all of a sudden. Yeah, that was impossible. You want to be the hero? Just You want to Okay, it, it's going to happen, but not exactly how I thought it was going to oh happen. God. You want to make new friends? Yoder! And Nima, I don't like it.
You're a fucking idiot, and I'm glad you're gonna die now. This is gonna be the most satisfying thing in this entire game. Please show it, and like, don't ever cut away. Keep showing this. Graphic detail. I'm just sad I lost the fight with him. But maybe you like had to. There was like no way that you couldn't. I mean, this is what I've been talking about the whole time, is that every time that they use the T-Rex to move the plot forward is really lazy. And I wish that they would stop. I mean, now this T-Rex is officially my hero. Because he ate Yoder, she ate Yoder. Which might be the greatest gaming moment in 2018. Wait, so you had to... I could pick there? Whether to choose the, the can or her? Interesting, I wonder if anything would have changed. That's not how this game is so far, so I doubt it. going on here. This is getting sillier and sillier by the uh, by the minute. How do you lose the T-Rex? It's a fucking T-Rex. Go right. Wait, what the hell am I doing? Go up. What is being accomplished here? Oh, that's lucky. I thought he was gonna go in it, which also would be probably pretty safe. But then, I don't know how you get out of that. Oh god. That is not good. I mean, yeah, this is probably the most uh, exciting and good chapter of this game so far. But it's still not, like, it's still not spectacular. Of course, it's the last one. The one where it's like, oh, you know, I'd actually want to play more of this. Uh, what the fuck? How do you get out of this situation? I don't think you do. That was lucky. Are the other two by the boat yet or not? Dad! Where's Nima? I feel like she's gonna die next. Even though Nima's been one of the only consistently like fine characters. Oh my god, come on. Holy fuck, why is this so hard? I'm really good at button mashing, but this is really difficult. That button mashing right there at the end was the final boss. Where's Nima? Did she make it on the boat or not? Also, I want to point out, I didn't screw up at all during that sequence. That was perfect. Okay, she did come with us. I thought we I left her for it. some reason. Believe me, the whole world is better off without that can. Guys? Not me, Joey. Not my daughter. Guys? Nima, I made a promise. I'll figure something out. Come back to Dallas with us. We'll find a way to get you and your Marikita. Guys! To... How much did you say those embryos were worth? Wait, what? The hell? Wait, so hold on. Someone... This boat just got here. 
They had Yoder's money and then they just died too? How'd they die? Alright. Well, I mean, at least the game ended on a confusing note, just like the rest of the game. So, I, I guess that's Jurassic Park the game. Holy shit. That was like... Not good. <laughs> I mean, it wasn't bad, but it certainly wasn't good. That's really the only way that I can possibly describe that game. Not quite terrible, but also not really what I expected or wanted. I guess for some reason they just went in a completely different direction with this game and made it so that you can't move any of the characters around and you had to go like scene to scene. Which I think was the first knock against this game. That is a very strange way to do this game. And none of your choices have any effect on anything. You can't get characters killed before they're supposed to. The story was fine. You know, it's just not... Not a very memorable... Story. Honestly, the... The cast of characters was mainly dull. You know, Nemo was the only character that I really say that I would, I would, that I would say that I would like. Jess was fine. She wasn't offensively annoying. She got, she had a few moments where she was kind of annoying. <clears throat> uh, what's his name? Jerry Harding is possibly one of the most boring main characters I've ever seen in a video game. Uh, I mean, at least the dinosaur stuff was pretty cool. They, uh, they built up the True Dons throughout the entire game and then did nothing with them, which is kind of fun. The Mosasaur also just kind of seemed like it was just randomly inserted in there. But it was fine. I really wouldn't... Uh, that's a perfect thing to say about this game. I won't remember you. Yeah, I would not. I'd certainly not recommend this to anyone. Nika Futterman's fine. Um, dude, Skullface was in this game? James Horan was Dr. Sorkin's assistant. Jason Marsden is one of those um, voice actors that he's in everything, and he's never had a character that doesn't sound different. Like, every single one of his characters sounds exactly the same. And, you know, his voice fits for some characters, but then there are some that it just doesn't. And I think he was a big reason why I didn't like Yoder. He was just annoying, but his voice definitely made him more... more annoying, I think, than he needed to be. Yeah, I mean, in terms of the Telltale games that I've played, this one is almost certainly the worst. You're really not gonna get any, uh... You're not gonna get any worse than this, I don't think. I mean, in some words, like, I would rather play this than the Guardians of the Galaxy game, because I genuinely don't care about Guardians of the Galaxy. So it's probably not the worst one for me specifically, but I think subjectively this is just the worst. Fernando J. Huerto, why do I know that name? I don't know. But yeah, that, that is not... Who the fuck is Barry 3D64 ampersand 3D65? Weird. Yeah, I, I would not play this game again. This game is dumb and I would not play it again. Uh, it's 2011, alright. So what was that, like, I think a year before... The Walking Dead. Which, man, they really turned it around. I mean, I still don't think Telltale games are perfect. But man, this shows what could go wrong. Alright, so I guess that's it. Uh, thanks for watching. I had fun? <laughs> I guess. Hopefully you did too. There were some fun moments in here, but overall it was kind of a miserable game. So, uh, see you next time.